Macon Mayor Robert Rickert is disappointed with the Appropriations Committee's decision to not fund consolidation costs. Last night, the committee turned down the ordinance that would have taken $250,000 from the city's reserve fund to cover the costs of consultants and attorneys. Rickert says hiring these people is very important because he believes we should have the best new government possible. For city council to say they're not going to pay for it or for the appropriations committee to vote two to two that they're not going to pay for it, I, I think is childish, it's immature, and it's very short-sighted in my opinion. The consolidation charter says that the city and county has to foot the bill for the transition costs, and some, including Councilwoman Elaine Lucas, who opposed consolidation from the get-go, says her constituents shouldn't have to pay for it. Rickert tells us that the next step is to try to get the full council to consider the issue further.